a heartbroken family suing Atlanta leaders, blaming the city of Atlanta for the death of eight year old Sequoia Turner. The little girl was in the back seat of a car when she was shot and killed by a stray bullet. CBS 46's Haley Mason joins us live in Atlanta. Haley, what's the latest? Sean, as you remember, this all happened last summer during the protest against the killing of Richard Brooks by Atlanta police. But there was a vigilante group involved that shot into the Turner's family car. Now this 36 page wrongful death lawsuit is blaming city leaders for not protecting against that group. We're forced to live through this day by day. The grieving parents of Sequoia Turner are taking their fight for justice to court, suing Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms, Atlanta Police Chief Rodney Bryant, City Councilwoman Joy Shepard, and Wendy's for wrongful death in the shooting of the eight-year-old girl. This lawsuit is based on a failure of city officials to provide even the most basic public safety and public protection. Their lawsuit says city leaders allowed armed and violent individuals to encamp and take control of a major city street by erecting barriers in the middle of University Avenue, which subsequently caused the shooting and killing of Sequoia. Turner and her family were riding by the Wendy's on July 4th last year on their way home when someone from an armed vigilante group shot into their car. The Wendy's had been taken over by protesters following the killing of Rayshard Brooks by Atlanta police. We believe the evidence shows that the mayor gave specific direction to the police chief and to the police department to stand down. All parties should be held accountable, um, not just the individual they currently have in custody. The attorneys say city leaders through public statements acknowledge their efforts to communicate with the groups at the Wendy's instead of calling in police. It wasn't until after Sequoia's tragic death that the city finally did what they should have done weeks before. We deserve justice. Someone needs to be held accountable. Now city leaders are responding to me this afternoon. Mayor Bottoms telling me that the murder of Sequoia Turner is a tragedy that no family should have to endure. But due to the anticipated litigation, the city of Atlanta is not going to comment. Meanwhile, Councilwoman Joy Shepard uh, says the pain still resonates with me and my heart goes out to the family. She's not commenting on the litigation either. Atlanta police saying they don't comment on pending litigation. And uh, to clarify, that was a mayor spokesperson sending us that statement. Next, we have a memo on why police were self told not to proactively patrol. That's coming up next hour on CBS 46. Back to you guys in the studio. Okay, Haley.